Hey guys, this is Noisy Boy coming to you loud and proud. Um, this is what we call a delve in Elder Scrolls Online. I just wanted to make a quick video about what these were all about. Now, in this particular mine, it's called Gerzox Mine. Um, delves are uh, delves are usually mines or caves where they are pretty much. It's just an area that's slightly harder, I'd like to say, and it also has a boss at the end. Now we'll just get into it, eh? First of all, oh sorry, first of all, just before we start, I'd just like to make a shout out to a couple of people. Um, first of all, Deltia from Deltia's Gaming. Mate, you're a champion at everything you do. And also, Aloha, I hope I pronounced that right. You're an ice queen, love, you're the best. And also, Cedric. Mate, you're what I call the faceless wonder, you're a champion. Alright, now that that's out of the way. The thing about Delves is that there's usually a... Uh, like I said, slightly harder, but when you come down here, there's usually items you can just pick up for provisioning, materials, weapons, armor. Um, and there's usually enemies in here that have what we call lieutenants, who are just slightly harder than your average um, person. Um, when I came down here, I didn't actually realize that there was uh, you had to come up against skeletons, because this was actually the first time I'd actually run it. So, as you can see, there's a wraith who are just... Like I said before, slightly harder than your normal guy, but I'm pretty over leveled for this one. But, um, oh, that guy got the, the jump on me a bit there. <laughs> but I think, um, I'm slightly over leveled for this one, or probably not slightly, but a lot. But just for the, um, video sakes, I just wanted to come down here and just show you what it was and not get ganked every five seconds. Um, yes, as you can see, I'm just chinking all the crates and stuff that I come by. Um, same with the enemies. This is like good place to um, oh not farm but just level up so to speak. And like I said, the enemies are slightly harder when you come to if you find a delve. Sometimes when you find a delve, it'll have a solo or a group one on it too. Sometimes, um, but like I said, you can just do it by yourself if you can, like I'm doing here. On this particular part here, I just kind of realised that uh. Enemies are getting to me quicker than I thought they would. I thought I would be able to just uh, destroy them in a couple of shots, but they're actually getting close, so I had to pull in a bit of backup. The old clan affair. I like to call him my little raptor. Um, he saved my butt that many times. Um, that's why I've kept them on board. I could have gone for the um, the flying lady one. I can't remember her name right now. The oh, the twilight something. I can't remember. Anyway, I call her. Um, she bitch, that's what I call her. So, um, she is probably stronger, but at the same time, this guy's my little tank. They always seem to want to kill my little raptor, and I just love it, and I just pick them off at a distance. At the same time, you got to do your strategy. Don't over, uh, don't underestimate these delves. You know, in seconds you can be surrounded by two, three, four enemies at a time with the lieutenant just running up behind them. Um, check your map often, you might miss uh, little uh, secret passages, so to speak. But um, just make sure you check the entire delve from top to bottom. Usually when you find a delve and you um, kill the boss that's in there, you get an achievement. Um, inside of your uh, options menu there is a uh, an achievement that you can follow. Um, but just for video sakes, I didn't actually check this one. But at the end you'll see after I beat the boss, we'll say completed achievement, so on and so forth. Now as a, as you can probably tell, this is probably the first time I've been down here, so I'm looking around every corner, being paranoid as usual. But you know, that's just the way it is with these delves. I'm pretty sure the boss isn't too far away. This is a little wraith, I love that liquid lightning move. Um, and my little uh, raptor just seems to just pull everyone away. Usually when you're when you're doing these delves, the bosses are not particularly hip, um, hard, but you know at the same time there's a. Uh, I find it good places to level up other skills. Like as you can see, I've got a resto staff on here now. Um, if you wanted to just uh, level up your second bar with your weapons, if you wanted to, or just um, abilities you don't use very often, delves would be perfect. Um, you don't have to, but like I said. It's one good spot to just uh, level up your stuff. I'm pretty sure the boss is coming up around here somewhere. It's got to be around here. Oh, yep, just around the corner here. 
the Retribution level 25 Wraith. Not too bad, I guess, but uh, just try and assess the situation. I don't want to see any uh, secret enemies hanging around. But of course, I bring out the big guns to start with my Storm Atronach. He's boss, man. He, he lo I love that guy. He's awesome. And as you can see, I make quick work of this little guy here. Um, and there you go, completed. Gerzak's Mine. You get that when you complete the mines or delves like this, and also an achievement. My Diedrich summoning went up, and good on you, Raptor dude, you're the man. Um, sometimes even when you come down in delves, you find these kind of second missions as well. And there you go, the achievement right there. Now, as you can see, this uh, video is about to come to an end. So if, you, uh, if this helped, please press the like button or subscribe to my channel. And as always, guys, stay noisy.